Hello, welcome to this week's Flip Learning. I'm Miss Natalie and we'll be looking at describing story settings. Who remembers what we were learning about last week? That's right, we were learning all about adjectives. An adjective is a describing word. So let's recap. We use adjectives to describe many things, such as people. We might say, the boy has black hair. Objects. We might say, the apple is red. Or feelings. The person is happy or the person is sad. We might describe places. The trees are green or the sky is blue. This week we're going to be describing settings. We use the word setting when we are talking about a place. There are lots of settings in our storybooks. For example, a forest. We might describe the setting a forest, saying the trees are tall or the grass is green. City, a village, a beach, or our setting might be in the mountains, in space, in a valley, or even in a haunted house. Our setting might be a castle, or a town, or a farm, or the Antarctic. So, we're going to have a look at some sentences now. But what must we remember to use at the beginning of every sentence? Yes, that's right, a capital letter. We must use a capital letter at the beginning of every sentence. Can you spot the capital letters here? And what must we remember to use at the end of every sentence? That's right, a full stop. For example, I go to school every day and the full stop is at the end of my sentence. And don't forget to use finger spaces so then we can tell which word is which. So a city. This sentence says the city was something with lots of people walking the streets. I wonder what the blank space is going to say. The city was busy with lots of people walking the streets. So the word busy is describing the city. The Antarctic. It was very something in the Antarctic. So my blank word is hot or cold. Which do you think is most suitable for that sentence? Pause the video and have a try. That's right. It was very cold in the Antarctic. The Antarctic is a very cold place, so hot wouldn't be the right word to use. Can you see I have started my sentence with a capital letter and ended it with a full stop? Next sentence. It was something up in the blank mountains. It was windy up in the tall mountains. There are two adjectives in this sentence the word windy and the word tall. Next one is about the castle. The old castle was very large. So old is describing the castle and the word large is also describing the castle. Next sentence. The trees next to the mountains were... Now, can you have a go at this one? Pause the video and see if you can think of adjectives to describe the trees next to the mountains. So the trees next to the mountains were tall and green. Now, you could practice describing some of the other settings by going back through the video. I hope you have enjoyed learning all about story settings. See you next week.